Okay, so she's in the clove oil. And still she's she's not really sedated yet. Still kind of moving around. I don't have a lot of water in the bucket, so I'm trying to make sure she stays submerged in the clove oil. But you want to make sure she's breathing, which she is. The key, from what I'm told, is that they will go limp. And that's really kind of the way to judge. Right now, she's still kind of fighting me when I push a little bit on her tail. She's not really relaxed yet. You can see her breathing, which is good because she's a strange one. When I grab a hold of her, she uh, stops breathing just because I've got her. <laughs> she doesn't like to be restrained, obviously. Now, the secret or the trick to this is not to leave them in it too long because it'll actually put them to sleep, in fact, euthanize them. So you don't want to do that. You just want to kind of make sure she starts to become subdued. And it looks like I got her pretty subdued. Again, you don't want to euthanize. You just want to kind of take the fight out a little bit. So you can still tell she's uh, fighting because she's really pushing with her tail. Oh, there we go. Okay. She's getting better. So this is the tricky part, trying to do this by yourself. I've got the gruel in the catheter, and you have to make sure the head's tipped back far enough. And the secret is to get the tip of the catheter in her mouth. Make sure, I was told, there's no air bubbles. So as she's breathing, I've also read, is when you want to do this. But there's a small opening here. So you'll see the catheter. Hopefully you'll see the catheter go in. Okay. You can actually see it going in. And the trick is to go past the trigger but not to the stomach. So this is the hard part. Too much and it just comes back out or it goes out the gills. Okay, we just saw it come out the gill. It's going out the gill. There, okay, she just snicked a little. Supposedly Part of the secret to this is to wait for them to breathe, too. Okay, she's not breathing, so I'm going to move her, excuse me, into the one that's the mix. Try to revive her a little bit. There we go. Yesterday to me too. Change is your slim to begin with. 